Hello, Doc. Hello, Doc. Doc, I cannot hear you. Hello. <laughs> oh, why are you shouting? <laughs> mm. Can you I, hear me? Yeah, but... But the volume is very slow. Is very low. Hello. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I will try to fix it. Okay. Can you speak one more time, Doug? Hello. <laughs> okay. I can hear you now. Okay. Why are you absent, Doug? Are you sick last time? You're not feeling good? Uh, yeah, yeah, I feel good. Oh, why? So are you okay now? Do you feel better now? Uh, 
Do you feel better now? Are you okay? Okay, very good. Okay, so now, Duke, we are going to have an activity tonight. Okay, hi, cute. Sing chow. Sing chow. Sing chow. Okay, so tonight, Duke, let's start our activity, okay? Wait a minute. I will try to, to adjust my volume. Wait for me. Hello, Joe. Hello. Good. Uh, what? You, you okay? Yes, yes, yes. I can hear you now. Um, you, you, you are fine. Yes, I'm fine. Are you fine too? Yeah. Okay, very good. Okay, very good. So now let's begin our activity for tonight, the. Okay. All right, so our first activity will be reading activity. So we have part number one, five marks. Okay, it says here, look and read. Put a tick or a cross in the box. Okay, so Doug, we have here some examples. Okay, example number one, this is a skirt. Check. This is a horse. Wrong, because that is a hippo. Okay, what's number one, Doug? Can you read it? Yes, yes. Oh, you read it first. It is a plane. Check. Because it is a plane. Check. Okay, very good. So number one is correct. Oh, how about number two, do? This potato. Wrong. Cross. Uh, this is a potato cross because what is that? It's onion. It's onion. Okay, number three. It's the piano. Jack. This is a piano. Check. Okay, very good. It's a sausage. Mm hmm. This is a sausage. Check. Next, number five. It is an ear. Okay, because what is that? It's a nose. It's a nose. All right, very good. Job. So you got five points in the first activity. Okay, now let's go to the next one. So look at the picture very carefully, Doug. And then say yes or no. Okay, so we have some examples. The man has got a boat. Answer is yes. Some children are playing football. Answer is no. Okay, number one, Duke, read and answer yes or no. Um, question one. There is cat on the wall. No. It's not well it. wearing shoes. No. Mm -hmm. No. A bar has got a cat. Yes. There is a baby and a monster. <coughs> yes. There are five dogs in the water. No. No. Okay. Very good, Duke. So you got a total of five points 
Okay, now this is part number three. Look at the picture, look at the letters, and write the words. Okay, so the example number one is O-L-D-L. -L. So the answer is doll, D-O-L-L. On number one, do? Um, bike, B-I-K-E. Very good. So the first one is bike, B-I-K-E, correct. On number two. Robot. R O T um, R O B O T. Okay, R O B O T next. Um, <coughs> a train. C R A N I I N. Again again. T T R A N I uh, I N. Okay, T R A I N. Number four. G O E T O N T R A R. Okay, very good. Guitar. Last one. Number five. Elephant. K. E L E. Hmm. E L E. P H. Hmm. A N T. Okay, very good. E L E P H A N T is elephant. All right, so five points again, Duke. Good job. All right, now, Duke, you have to read the story about a garden and choose the words from the pictures. Okay. I am building the street and a house. I a street and a family in the house. <coughs> um, sleep in the house. Chair, the children is play computer and tennis is me father sits on a chair and read in me there is a tree some apple life with some uh, apple apples this is a tree some apple oh you read it first a bird. Okay. Bird. The children eat big red apple from one tree. What I am? I am the garden. Okay, very good. <coughs> so the first one is treat, family, badminton, chair, birds, and apples is correct. Okay, Doug, five points again for you. All right, so now let's proceed. Look at the pictures and read the question. Write one word answer. So this one has five points. Example, where is the man? So the answer is in the bedroom. What is he doing? Answer is sleeping. Okay, number one, Duke. Where is the man glasses? Under the... Um, under the uh, um, the tree at the bed. Again, where is the man's the glasses? Under the bed. Okay, under the bed. Okay, number two, do. Which room is the phone in? <clears throat> the, the, the kitchen. A what? <clears throat> this is um a kitchen. Which room is the phone in? In the kitchen. That is correct. Oh, next one. 
who is opening the door? The daddy or daddy or man or father. Okay, the man or the father. Very good. Our next one, just number three. Question four has a man caught his hand. This is a table. This is a table. A banana. Oh, you didn't answer this one. What has the man got his hand? Answer is banana. Our next one. Where are? Where are going the boy? Where are going the boy? Mm -hmm. In the sand, in the sand, on the sand, on the sand, on the floor. On the floor, not on the sand. There's no sand there, though. Okay, okay yeah. next. Okay, so we are done with the first part. Wait for me, do. Okay, so the next um, part of the activity will be listening. Okay, so now this one is part number one. Listen and draw. There is one example. Okay, duh. now let's listen very carefully and draw your line to your answer. So let's start. Part one. Look at part one. Now look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Can you see the book? Pardon? The book. Can you put it in the cupboard? OK. It's in the cupboard. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. 1. Now the pineapple. Put it between the ball and the duck. Mmm, what a nice pineapple. Yes. Put it between the ball and the duck, please. I'm putting it there now. Two. What? I Please put listen. the ruler <coughs> under the table. What is it, do? I don't listen clearly. I don't listen clearly, okay. The picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Can you see the book? Pardon? The book. Can you put it in the cupboard? OK. It's in the cupboard. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. 1. Now the pineapple. Put it between the ball and the duck. Mmm. What a nice pineapple. Yes. Put it between the ball and the duck, please. I'm putting it there now.
two. And please put the ruler under the table. Put what under the table? The ruler. Oh, okay. Three. <coughs> now the computer. Put it in the box. It's a new computer. Where do I put it? In the box, please. Right. Four. And can you put the camera on the bed? The camera? Yes. Put it on the bed. OK. Five. Can you see the coconut? Yes. Where can I put it? Next to the monkey, under the clock. All right. The coconut's next to the monkey now. Now listen to part one again. OK, finish. Okay. One. <coughs> All right, let us check this number one. The pineapple in between the ball and the dog. Correct. Two, the ruler and under the table. Correct. Wait a minute, Duke. Wait a minute. Okay. Okay, number three, the computer in, in the box. Correct. Also, four, the camera and on the bed. And last one, the coconut and next to the monkey under the clock. <coughs> okay, that is also correct. So total of five points. Now, Duke, this one is part number two. So you have to read and write a name or a number. All righty, let's listen now. Part 2. Look at the picture. Listen and write a name or a number. There are two examples. How do you spell your name, Tony? My name? Yes. It's T-O-N-Y. Thank you. And how old are you? I'm 11. 11? Yes, that's right. Can you see the answers? Now you listen and write a name or a number. 1. Have you got a brother, Tony? No, I haven't. But I've got four sisters. Wow! That's a lot! Yes, it is. Two. And do you like your sisters? Yes. My favorite is my baby sister, Kim. Do you write that K I M? Yes. I don't She's listen funny. Clearly. She eats her I books. <laughs> okay. And write a name or a number. There are two examples. How do you spell your name, Tony? My name? Yes. It's T-O-N-Y. Thank you. And how old are you? I'm 11. 11? Yes, that's right. Can you see the answers? Now you listen and write a name or a number. 1. Have you got a brother, Tony? No, I haven't. But I've got four sisters. Wow! That's a lot! Yes, it is. Oh, wait. Okay. 2. 
And do you like your sisters? Yes. My favorite is my baby sister, Kim. Do you write that K I M? Yes. She's funny. She eats her books. <laughs> oh dear. Three. Okay. And where does your family live? We live in Bus Street. Is that B U S? Yes. My house is behind my school. Bus. Four. And what's the number of your house? It's number fifteen. Sorry, number fifteen. Oh, thanks. Number fifteen. Do you like your house? <coughs> yes, my friend lives in the house next to us. What's your friend's name? It's Alex. That's A L. E X. That's a nice name. <coughs> now listen to part two again. All right. So now let's check the. Oh, you got. Where's the last? Check. Um, you, check. How do you? Well, where's your answer in the last one, Doc? Number five. You check. I respond. Okay, you write check. it. What letter is that? A L E X. Okay, so now let's read. Number one, how many sisters has Tony got? Four. What's the name of Tony's favorite sister? Kim. Where does Tony's family live? Boss. What's the number of Tony's house? Fifteen. What is the name of Tony's friend? It's Alex. All right, Duke. Good job for you. Perfect score again. All righty. Now, Duke, let's have. Part number three. Listen and tick the box. There's one example. Part three. Look at the pictures. Listen and look. There is one example. What's May giving Ben for his birthday? Here you are, Ben. Happy birthday. Thank you, May. What is it? A bus? No, and it isn't a car. Oh, it's a truck. Wow, that's great. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. Where's the soccer game? Lucy, come and watch the soccer with me. Where? On TV or in the park? In the school hall. Our friends are playing now. Oh yes. Okay. What? Do. What What's Bill doing? Yes. You can listen. You didn't listen clearly. Yeah. Okay. okay. Part three. <coughs> look at the pictures. Listen and look. There is one example. What's May giving Ben for his birthday? Here you are, Ben. Happy birthday! Thank you, May. What is it? A bus? No, and it isn't a car. Oh, it's a truck! Wow, that's great. 
Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. Where's the soccer game? Lucy, come and watch the soccer with me. Where? On TV or in the park? In the school hall. Our friends are playing now. Oh yes. Okay. Two. What's Bill doing? Hello, Mr. Black. Can Bill come and play? Is he having breakfast? Good morning, Tom. No, but he is here. Is he sleeping? I don't know. Oh, look! Here he is. He's talking on his phone. Okay, now let's see the. The example is what is me drinking? So the answer is letter A. Okay, next one. Where is the soccer game? Answer is letter B, correct? Two. What is Bill doing? Answer is letter C. All right. Very good. Good. Next one. Three, four, and five. Three. Which animal is in the story today? Please, can you read me a story, Mommy? Yes, but not the tiger story again. Okay, and I don't want the one with the goat. He's ugly. I know. Let's read about the happy spider. Four. Where is Anna's pen? Mr. White. I can't find my pen. It isn't in my bag. Is it in your desk, Anna? I don't know. I can see it. It's on the floor. Oh, Anna. Five. Who's in the photo? Is that your grandma? Or your mum in the photo, Pat. I like her long hair. You are funny. It's not one of them. So who is it? It's my big brother. He's got long hair. Okay, now let's see which animal is in the story today. Answer is letter A, a spider. Where is Anne's pen? Let her be in the classroom. Who is in the photo? All right, it's letter A. Very good, Duke. Again, you got a perfect score. All right, so for the last part of the activity, you have to listen and color the pictures here. Okay, Duke? So now let's try to listen. Part four. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. It's a beautiful day. Yes, the children are playing in the garden. One boy's playing with a boat. Can you colour his T-shirt green? OK, a green T-shirt for the boy with the boat. Can you see the boy with a green T-shirt? This is an example. Now you listen and colour. One. There are some fish in the water. Yes, that boy's looking at them. Can I colour his T-shirt orange? OK. The boy next to the fish can have an orange T-shirt. Good orange shirts. Okay, what? Orange shirts. Okay. Two. Look at that girl. She's giving food to the chickens. That's good. 
Make her T-shirt brown. OK, I'm colouring her T-shirt brown. Good. The chickens are happy with their food. Three. I like the boy with the kite. Yes. Let's make that boy's T-shirt red. OK, that's good. A red T-shirt for the boy with the big kite. Red bookie. Four. And look at that boy. Which one? The one with the crocodile. Colour his T-shirt yellow. Is he making that crocodile? Yes, he is. Give him a yellow T-shirt. OK. Five. Look, that girl's eating a cake. Oh, yes. Can I colour her T-shirt blue? Blue? Yes, OK. Would you like a cake too? Yes, please. Come on then. Let's go and get one. Great. Now listen to part four again. Okay, so now let's check. Number one, color the t-shirt of the boy looking at the fish orange. Correct? Two, color the t-shirt of the girl giving food to the chickens brown. Okay, number three, color the t-shirt of the boy with the kite red. Four, color the t-shirt of the boy making the crocodile yellow. And number five, color the t-shirt of the girl eating the cake. Eating the cake blue. Oh, not watering the plants, though. Okay, so four points. This must be the color blue. Okay, so now let's have the last activity for tonight. Wait for me, duck duck. Oh. All right, so now, Du, let's have the speaking practice. So, what is your hobby, Du? Uh, hobby? I don't understand. A hobby means these are the things that you want to do. Hmm. Play piano. Okay, so you want to play a piano. Okay, so why would you like to play a piano, Duke? Mm, I like that. Oh. Play. Okay, so you like playing a musical <coughs> instrument, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. so now Duke, look at the picture, and now I want you to describe. It. Okay, what can you say about this? Okay. In the garden or yard, it has six people. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. The grandpa is in the flower. The dog is on the window. The mom are girls. And drinking juice. The, the children is it um the uh, or 
marriage. The sister and the baby. Uh, mm, uh, eat orange. Mm -hmm. The bird is in the sky. The cat in the garden. In the lease yard. In the yard. Mm -hmm. he, <clears throat> oh, what else can you say? That's all. Mm -hmm. That's all the Hmm, finish? Yes. Okay, so so now um what do you think is this place? Where is there? The um, yard or garden. Okay, it's a yard or garden where? What is that? Is that in the house? Yes. Okay, so that is in a house. So as you can see, the, the family is very busy picking up oranges from the trees, okay? So now, Duke, read the words here on the screen. There are pictures here. Okay, Riley, ladder, pigs, lizard. Okay, so what is a ladder, Doc? Mm, what? What is a ladder? I don't understand. What do you mean by a ladder? On the first picture, what do you mean by ladder? I, I, I don't understand. What is the meaning of ladder or what is it? Is the I don't know. Okay, so as you can see, a ladder is um used to climb trees. Okay. Okay, now next one the pick. Or oh, what do you mean by pick? Pick is in the tree. Uh, cat the the um, in the fish uh, mm, the um, uh, people and uh, okay so pick means the people are picking up or getting some fruits or on trees or in some kind of plants. Okay, how about a lizard? Duck? What is a lizard? Mm, lizard. Mm -hmm. mm. In the yard. In, in the yard. Okay, so what is it? In the lizard. Oh, what is a lizard? Laser in the yard. It's in the yard. Yeah, what is it? Is it a fruit? Is it a vegetable? Or what is a lizard? It's an animal. Yes, <coughs> it is an animal. So where can we usually see a lizard? Mm, I don't know that. Okay, so usually we see lizards inside the house or sometimes in the yard, okay? All right. Okay, so Duke, that ends our um, activity for tonight. Okay, so I'm going to see you again on Wednesday evening. Okay, Duke? Okay. All right. Good night, night. Good night, teacher. See you again. See you again. Chukmungun. Chukmungun.